How many of you see people in some part of the world, in my country, for example, you'll see this in the middle of America where there's certain places that have cyclones all the time, or maybe down in New Orleans or places where every few years you get a huge storm that wipes out everybody right on the coast there. But then two years later, it happens again. They rebuild, it happens again. How many have ever thought to yourself, why don't these people move? And why don't they move, guys? Because it's what they're conditioned. They call that home. I don't want to leave my home, it's what I know. It's easy to see when it's somebody else and it's physical. It's harder to see when it's yourself and it's emotional, because we have an emotional home. Some of you grew up in a really tough environment. I did too. Pretty brutal environment. Very painful environment. Part of I am who I am is because I didn't want to suffer. I had to find answers. And because I suffered so much, I don't want you to ever suffer if I can do anything about it. I can't control it, but I can help massively. But it's only because I suffered so much I don't want anybody else to. 